Hey guys, it's Gravy here. Welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be. Oh boys, guys, we we're gonna get into some topics today. This is about 2K and how I think my team's done. So um, before we get into that, like the video, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and let's get onto it. So I don't want you guys to mistake um this for the um everything I hate about 2K. This isn't what I hate, it's just how they messed up a lot. And some of these like are not major things, some of them are little things, but some of them are big things. The first thing is, they have not had a l limited event for so long. Like literally, they have the limited, they c is, like, can they not give us limited events anymore? Like, literally they had, they had one limited ev event, right? And it was for the, p p uh, the cards and triple set online. And then, and, th and they ended on Tuesday, so literally they didn't get any daily event, anything. Just this now, so that's a bit rubbish. Right now, triple the offline vault is messed up. Literally, if you open it, you don't. If you get um finish the game, you don't get the vault. You have to go to extras and click click on redeem prize. It'll be here, and if you click on it, you lose your vault. So basically, you just wasted your time, and I'm not even sure they fixed that yet. And a lot of people have made videos about most balling DBG, um. Loads of people, um, what's his name? Bio2k. Loads of people have made videos about it. Uh, also, it took them so long to put the new vault in, like, they couldn't have done it with all the other content. They had to delay it by, like, two hours. Like, come on, man. Another thing is, they literally trolled us with the unlimited rewards. Like, this is basing off t uh, JD Crossover's new video. But he even said it himself. They literally, they gave us all these juiced rewards and they were really good. And now, we're back to getting, literally, if you get, if you go, 6-0, which actually isn't, like, 6-0 isn't that easy. That's like at least two hours of gameplay if they don't quit. Actually, if they don't quit, that's like four hours of gameplay. And you get eight tokens. Four hours. You can literally go into Triple Threat Online, play for four hours, end up getting like 50 tokens, like 150 tokens or something, and then get like 20k MT. Like, that's not worth it. Um, also, I, I like servers are so bad in the EU, and like you have to play a specific time zone, which personally I'm fed up with it. Like, I'm not even joking, guys, I'm not playing this game anymore. Like, the thing is with me, guys, I am going to still be doing videos. Like, I, I'm still, I still love, I still love, you know, the new plays. I'm st I still love the, you know, new cards, all of that, the new stuff dropping, blah, 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 new unlimited rewards. Like, I'm still happy. I'm still fine. I'm still going to make videos about this type of stuff, guys. Don't worry. I will stay and be a mighty YouTuber. However, I will not play. I refuse to play at specific time zones just because they, the the servers are messed up. And Ameri people in America, they don't even know about it. But when it hits them, they are going to go mad. It's going to be harder there for them. And Unlimited is just not fun for me. Like, even if I play in a specific time zone, like, all they do is, all people do it. Like, the co like I'm not, not going to feel an ambush here and talk about the community being toxic. But it is a bit, you've got to admit, like, why do you, like, literally, an innocent person can play into Unlimited, just having some fun trying to, trying to try out their new card, all they get, overall glitching with Galaxy Falls, toxic name, a toxic picture, a toxic court, toxic jerseys, um, five out, and, li like, literally just do, run around screens, shoot, get greens, pause every time you score, uh, send like messages like haha you lost and that's it that's why it's not fun and they make people quit another thing is they also like scammed people with buzzer beaters 2k like what is that about do you not remember when they had the buzzer beaters out for 20 minutes and they didn't even address it they did not even address it people just wasted their money people like some people might have spent like a thousand 
Like, I'm not even joking. Some people, some really, like, for example, you never know. Like, some, like, basketball players, for example, that play this game, they may have wasted, like, $500 on it. Like, some, at least, at least, people have at least, people really spent, like, 2000 altogether around the world, at least. And they scammed them out of it. And why have they made the Spotlight Sim Super Packs VC only? And look at this. 7,500 VC for one pack, right? Why can't they do it like this? Why can't they do it like that? Why? And no one even ripped these packs. Another thing, the pack was also terrible. Yesterday, guys, I literally had to wait an hour and a half for, for all the cards to be listed up. And that's not even joking. I had to wait an hour and a half for someone to list up Bob Sura. And even now. Like, there's only like. There's only like 21. 21 cards. And not only that. Why have they done this for two weeks? No one's why, like what two K? What was the point of that? What was the point of that? I don't even get it myself. Why have they done that? And another thing is like, so these this is gonna be some information from Phantoms guys. Check him out. He comments on. He makes videos about everything in the two K community. Troy Dan called out NB2K24 being trash because, like, if you did not watch, uh, f you should watch Phantoms because he made a video about it. But Troy Dan literally, he was trying to shoot and it didn't let him shoot, and he literally like stood up, paused the game, and started screaming, saying, "Why can't I pause? This game is so bad." Also, they scam people into buying NB2K20 because, like I was talking about Phantoms, um, he made a video, uh, about. How they lied in their blog, right? Saying before that 2K21, they said there will be no longer, you know, um, people, you know, uh, using out position players, no longer that, blah, blah, blah. People ended up buying, people bought this game, at least a thousand people bought this game because of, they thought it was going to be no, you know, glitching. But they went and did this. They literally went. And did this and gave us a shooting guard Dirk Nowitzki point guard T Mac. And it's your point guard Ben Simmons. Actually, I understand that point guard Ben Simmons. But why have you given us a flipping point guard Giannis, a point guard Wes Unsold, a point guard Jokic? She's a center. They literally scammed us into buying the game. Another thing, they are such money grabbers, guys. They are such money grabbers. If you don't believe me, and tell me why for two weeks they did not finish they did not fix an unlimited glitch that they could have fixed in one day because they don't care they care more about people spending their money on this game which i understand but they don't have to be that much of money grabbers another thing is uh the ambush scandal oh my god like i understand they fired him and stuff but still why? Like, what? Oh, 2K. D don't you think that's a sign? Don't you think that's a sign that even your own people you've signed a contract with, for them to be in partnership with you, are ranting about your game? You gave Troy down a locker code. He was ranting about your game. Also, with the kills of my locker code, I understand that they apologise for it, right? And I understand it was, I don't, I'm not blaming Kilsamoy, guys. Kilsamoy, he was very professional. It wasn't his fault. So I don't blame him at all, guys. But, like, 2K. I waited three hours in that stream. Like, I'm not even joking. I didn't turn, I refused to turn off my laptop. Because I wanted to see it. And nothing, like, nothing happened. And then, they literally, parent, they literally wasted three hours of my life. I'm not mad at kills anymore. I'm mad at 2K for that. Another thing is, they literally gave, haven't given Fly his uh, little, like, like, was it 2K thing next to his name in the park? And they also, 
might win on a rant about this game. So personally guys, I don't know about you, but I'm like I'm personally done with playing this game. The only way I'll come back to this game is one, they fix servers, one, two, they actually care about the game and stop putting these packs out. Three, um we get some good offline stuff because like the triple threat offline vault is broken. Domination is boring. I'm not grinding 180 hours to get Kobe, even though it's Kobe. So, I'm pretty much done with this game. I'm literally playing Madden. Like, I'm literally grinding out Madden. And that's not even a joke. But that's going to cap it off, guys. So, the next video today will be later on. It will probably be a video for new content. Hopefully, we get something good. Hopefully, 2K don't money grab again like they always do. But this is going to cap it off, man. Comment down below and I'll to 2 million million. I'm joking. We're not at 2 million million. Uh, but can you help me please get to 20 subs? Because I'd really appreciate it. And thanks for watching. Bye.